third division of the Atlantic Sire Stakes B division moving up in behind that Metro Home Building Center starting gate for race seven. Let's go back upstairs for the call to track announcer Vance Cameron. Nothing to prove. Camp Coach Zachary, Gordy's last ball. Johnny Jack, the Fox, Cool Westward, Camp Co. Why not? Two year old Cole Pacers, top of the stretch. They're approaching a start. The rough and pacing, leaving out. It's Johnny Jack, Cool Westward from the outside. Nothing to prove at the rail third. As they round the turn, getting away fourth, that is the Fox, racing from fifth. It's Campco Zachary, then six towards the inside. Campco, why not? And the trailer, Gordy's last pole. So along the back stretch and race to the opening quarter, cool westward in line to David Downing, and there's the inquiry sign. Race number seven is under a judge's inquiry. On the point, cool westward, the leader. Racing from second, that's Johnny Jack. Rounding the turn third, nothing to prove, 30. And for the opening quarter, that's the Fox racing from fourth. Tipping out in fifth is Camp Co. Zachary. Then six is Camp Co. Why not? The trailer, Gordy's last ball. Down the stretch for time one. Up front on the lead is Cool Westward. Here comes nothing to prove now, Adam. Third up the rail at the opening half is Johnny Jack. Up fourth on the outside is Camp Co. Zachary. The Fox moves out fifth, racing from six. Camp Co. Why not? Gordy's last ball, the trailer, the half. In 102 and three, moving over to the 5 H. Cool Westward at the rail. Nothing to prove. Right alongside, coming up third from the outside, Camp Co. Zachary. Fourth on the cones is Johnny Jack. Then fifth, that is the Fox. Up the inside is Camp Co. Why not? He's sixth. Gordy's last bowl is seventh. Three quarters in the books. One. 32 and 4, 30 and 1 in the third, with an eight left to go. Cool Westward, the leader. Nothing to prove is second. Coming third on the outside, Camp Co. Zachary up the passing lane. Johnny Jack, they're in deep. Stretch now. Johnny Jack, nothing to prove. Johnny Jack up the inside. Might have got there for Arsenal. Nothing to prove is there in the win photo. 203 flat. Tight again at the uh, wire here tonight in race number seven, Atlantic Sire Stakes, two-year-old Colt B division. Uh, Kurt, we thought uh, that Cool Westwood would get out front and cut this here tonight. Romo to the outside, Kenny to the inside. Who won it? Oh, it's pretty close. I think maybe nothing to prove on the outside. Romo maybe by an edge, but we'll see here in the photo. But how about Cool West? We're cutting it out here with the aggressive drive by Dowling. 30 and 4, 102 and 3, 132 and 4. Romo was sitting three. He came first over. Kenny Arsenal was in the two hole, and he moves up the pass lane here, and they hit the nose together at the wire. The photo is up, and we are also under an inquiry. We'll see the results of the photo and the inquiry here in race seven, the Atlantic Sire Stakes B division. We have two inquiries, Kurt. The first one involving the start. Ladies and gentlemen, retain your tickets here in the seventh. The judge's inquiry involves the start, and the second inquiry involves the conduct coming towards the opening half mile. Two inquiries in the seventh.
Here comes Johnny Jack into the seventh race winner's circle. Bay Pacing Co. 2 by Westward Ho Hanover from the Water Tower Dam Water Sprite. Owned and trained by Travis Campbell of Gardner Mines, Nova Scotia. Kenny Arsenal is in the driver's seat to give the Colts a new pacing record of 203. Johnny Jack in the Atlantic Sire Stakes. 